Farsi Review here. Let's talk about something pretty cool that came from Traxxas. Finally, beadlock wheels. So here they are. I just installed them on my Bronco. So these are the Traxxas uh, method beadlock wheels in chrome with um, a red beadlock um, or a red ring, so to speak. So the pricing for this is twenty four dollars for four of the chrome and um, if you just want black that's sixteen uh, and um, sixty dollars for the rings uh, so yeah, four times you have a total of eight rings uh, because you have one on each side so twenty four plus sixty that's um, eighty four not too bad uh, a pro line um, fault line is 60 bucks, so a little more than the ProLine plastic, uh, which is pretty nice as well. But ProLine doesn't come with the colors. This comes in red, black, green, blue, silver. It comes in 1.9 and 2.2. This is the 1.9. And it's cool. It's stock, matches their colors. Um, uh, it's good to have that option uh, from Traxxas. They're also selling the um, <coughs> pre-mount so four wheels um, and four tires for a hundred forty dollars so the thing with beadlocks not sure if you know is they come like this comes with um, rings to lock the tire that means you could take them on and off uh, easily or you can replace your tires um, once they wear out reusable so you can change your foam change your tire etc one big problem is they're not that easy to change. Uh, Proline was hideous. Uh, they have something like 30 screws, um, which is almost impossible because it's, it's, it's a stiff screw. You have to drive it into plastic. It takes forever. You know, take, take it four hours uh, if you did it by hand. So you act, actually bought a drill, um, um, an, Allen, an Allen drill, so you could, you could work on this. Just imagine 30 screws on each side, here and then here, times four. Jesus. So the Traxxas actually comes with less. How many does it come with? It comes with 12 screws per side, so 24. Um, make quicker work of it. Um, so, and it mounts really easily, really solid. So good good job to that. And it looks, it looks amazing. So there you go. So I'll give you a tip before we close. The best upgrade you can do on your car, you have your Defender, you have your, you have your, um, Bronco or your new, that new TRX Sport is wheels and tires, bar none. Nothing else will make a difference. Uh, shocks, if shocks are fine, uh, motor, you don't need that. You don't need a Brussels motor, Jesus. Uh, what you need is wheels and tires. So for wheels, what you want is the, um, the, uh, the Proline, uh, what do you call it, the Hyrax. Um, they have some new sticky rubber. It is amazing. Uh, there's also uh, other brands out there, um, and more important is the foam. You want foam that's fairly uh, soft on the outside, because just like a rock crawler, you know, you, you, you uh, rock crawlers they don't they, uh, they they don't go out on the ro on the on the trail rocky trail at 30 psi. They go to like 10 psi or lower. Simulated look. So here I have a softer air pressure, or not air pressure, softer foam than in the rear. I want more grip here. So tires are number one with soft foam. And these new foams from Proline and Crawler Innovations have uh, dual density foam. So you don't want it soft all around because when you're side healing, uh, you want a little bit of structure. Uh, so you want uh, a stiff structure uh, on the bottom and a soft one on the outside to give you articulation. And the other tip I'll give you, super pro tip, you can do it with um, beadlocks. Um, so this is a Proline beadlock, weighs nothing. And um, it's unfortunate. Um, you can get a steel beadlock, uh, RC four wheel drive or some of these Chinese companies uh, that are about 100 grams each, very expensive, um, but they work. It's, it's one of the best upgrades you can do. Yeah is um, um, get a heavy wheel 
uh, and our drive train can take it. You know, if you have a monster truck or a cheap car, a heavy wheel can, can wear on the parts without. But this drive, uh, drive train is so strong, it's not an issue. So here is a weighted one. It weighs like four times as much as this. Uh, I think I put 80 grams of lead weight in here. I just, I just wrapped it around. I use solder actually, but you can use the fishing weight and wrap it around. Um, and you can actually, to do another trick, you could put more weight on the front than the rear. So you can distribute your weight as well by putting uh, heavy, heavy wheels on the front and maybe not on the rear. So you can ba balance that way. So there you go. Thank you.